Hey Summers, happy Valentine's Day! Today I'm going to be explaining the new SDX drop, which means Sims Delivery Express, I think. Basically, the Sims team introduced Vidaligo to the game, and I'm going to be exploring this today. So I have like a sim here. Uh, they introduced like over 61, I think, over every life stage. So infants, toddlers, children, teens, young adult, adult, and elder. So I'm going to be exploring every life stage. I'm just going to add some sims. I'm going to add eight so we can just explore every single life stage. And I'm sorry if I sound a little bit stuffy. I'm getting over a little cold. Let's start with infant. Yeah, let's just go over here and like change all the life stages. So it should be under skin details. Oh wow, that's, that's a lot of them. I wasn't expecting that much. Um, these are birthmarks, but these ones should be the vitiligo. It's definitely a lot. And I really like that, that they added so many different varieties. That's these two birthmarks. Um, so we can explore some of these kinds. Let me get, I know they have it on body too. Yeah, they have these ones. So many different kinds. Yeah, this one has a lot too. Some of these are like, uh, uh, birthmarks. But the ones that are like more whitish are the vitiligo. So like this one. Oh, it's nice how you can add multiple ones. I think it might just be for... I think they broke it up into different var variants. Like, you can only get one for the legs, but you can mix and match the leg ones with the arm ones. And the stomach ones. Yeah, I kind of like that. That one's like higher. Um, kind of like different, different like torso, arms, legs, face, all different kinds so you can't like mix and match but the same kinds but you can mix and match like where they're placed I guess some ones in the back uh, I guess we're gonna explore the face ones further but this one this one so these definitely seem to be just one. You can't really mix and match with these. It's just one for the face. But it's still so many different ones. Okay, I feel like I'm done with this one. This sim. Uh, let's see if we can get our diaper again. So yeah, I really like how... how um, how much they even have some like on the bottom of the feet which is a pretty good detail um, I heard that they took all of these and had like remake them for every single life stage or like every single one to where they changed changed um, size because they just want it like go on the same way also I think you can layer if I'm right they said you can layer them with like other skin details every other skin detail except birthmarks because they use like the same thing as birthmarks. So if I do this, it's not gonna, it's not gonna be there because it's like the same coding, I guess. And that makes sense. Um, oh wait, these are stork bites. Yeah, these are stork bites. These down here are birthmarks. I got them confused. Pretty much all the skin details I have for infants. Okay, let's go to toddlers now. Okay, there seems to be every single variant for every single life stage. Just somehow like missing like the same thing. Which is good, so you can like, as your sim ages up, they can still have like the same skin detail, it just won't go away from age. Okay, got this one. I uh, guess I can take off the hat. This one. This one. There's so many different variants, it's actually pretty cool. You can see how many different places there are it's just a lot it's way more diverse than the birthmarks they definitely have more types than the birthmarks but it's still evident that they worked for a very long time in this because you can see all the different variants
Okay, you can see the some of them on the back. And different kinds on the torso and the and the arms. And some some of the legs. Get them on one leg kind of. Also you can get them on both. Then, like I said, you can't get birthmarks on the same. Like, you can't get birthmarks on the same time as you get the vitiligo, but it's still pretty useful if you pair them with other skin details. Okay, let's go to child sims. So, I can definitely get some freckles here. And then I can also get vitiligo. So many different variants. It's really diverse. Then I can get some on the body. So like I said before, you can only get on like different areas. You can't just get like, you can't pick like the same area for one. Like all these are separate, then all these are separate. There are different kinds. Okay, let's move on to team. So I can give him some wrinkles, make him look older, different skin details. And I can also give him vitiligo, which is a good detail. Like I said, it's it's totally different subset. Okay, this makes him look old. Hold on a second. I can give him a tattoo and I can also give him vitiligo. So that's a good detail. Like I said before, it's it's totally different from the other ones. You can see some of it here. Some of the legs. Ooh. Now I'm gonna go to young adult. Um from here it goes like pretty much the same. It's it's just kind of repetitive for the adults, but I'm still going to show you. But it's like pretty much the same. Got the same skin details. Different types. It should have like different variants for skin colors. So like if I um, use uh, this one and then I go to, I change his skin tone. They kind of just change slightly depending on how warm or cool or neutral your skin tone is. It'll get like lighter or darker. As you can tell, the vitiligo is changing. Depending on how dark or light your skin tone is. So it's a pretty good detail because um, vitiligo doesn't have like different skin sliders or like uh, different options but it does change depending on your uh, skin tone so I got this one on the back this one on the front and some on the arms so yeah it's basically like that um I there's so many different shades you can get from this different kinds. Same thing with adults for teens and elders. They just have like different wrinkles and stuff that they have.
But this is a pretty cool update, especially because it's free. Got some in the back. Also, these do change. They don't change the color, but they do change, like, if it's on one leg or the other, as you see. You can get on both legs. For the, like, the legs and the arms, they do change. But it's not, like, different colors. It's more, like, different legs. Like, with the arm, you can see it goes from this one or to the other one. Which is definitely more detailed than you'd expect. Go to Elder, and see, pretty much the same as the other ones, except this one is lighter, because of her skin tone. Get some on the body as well. Mm. See, it's not as noticeable, but it's still there. legs I think that's it for the SDX drop thank you guys so much for watching make sure you subscribe hit that like button and comment bye